Hi, just a quick follow-up from my previous video when I talk about material. In this scenario, there is a way that is better that you don't have to replicate your type flow. You just need to create a multi-sub material with different IDs and then in your type flow object, you apply type select, change to elements, the gizmo, you move to touch only the part that you want to change the material and then you apply material and change the ID. Basically that's it. My previous video I show another way that you have to create separate flows, make this object one flow and this other. In some case that will apply just fine, will be the better way, but here in this scenario is much better. Thanks to guys from Typeflow group in Facebook, they come up with this solution. I will post here the guy. Thank you very much. See you next one.